my god. You know what's funny? The original Super Mario Bros. I have a way more difficult time with. The one where, like, I don't know. The one on the... Yeah, I think it's the NES. But yeah. I've still never even beat that game. I always die at, like, World 6 for some reason. You know what? I think we can just do the whole entire thing. Maybe. You know what? Actually... Yeah, let's do the whole entire World 1 in this episode because it's too short. What is this? Oh, this was a world. That looks awesome. It looks like you're gonna have to stay on this green panel and, um, you know, dodge things along the way. I recognize this music. Right now I got nine lives, like a cat. Yeah. And, um, flying Goombas, okay. Oh, oh, and I want that. Alright. Raccoon Mario is back in action. Or Tanuki Mario, whatever the heck it's called. You can flutter. And you can whack people. I don't know what else you can do. Because I'm a noob. Yeah, this thing is like really, really good. I'm just gonna keep going forward and whack anyone that even tries to stop me. And look at this water. It's not gonna be able to do anything. Oh, okay. Never mind. Free star coin. That's cool. That's pretty cool. You know, if this level ends soon, I'm going to be disappointed because this game is just being a little too... Oh, frick! Okay, I almost died. Um, gotta jump over these, I think. Nice, nice, very nice. Let's do a long jump. <laughs> I'm so used to Galaxy where, like, the long jumps are ridiculous, you know? Like, you can just freaking power through it. Okay, so... Looks like I'm back at the beginning, guys. Saying how easy it was, and then I just die on you guys. That's that's cool. And I don't have Mario Tanuki, dude. Now I do. Okay, that's good. Well, looks like I'm not doing a no death playthrough. That would have been pretty amazing, though, to like beat the whole entire game without even looking at anything from the game, not even playing it once, and then like not dying at all. But nope, I died on the world 1-3, whatever 1-4. I already lost track. That's cool. And I got uh, 76 coins. Okay, about to get a new life again. Yeah, I'm, uh, screw coins. I'm not gonna like go out of my way to get coins because that'll end up that'll causing me to die or something. <laughs> I almost died again. I was like nervous. Okay, so before I was like three inches away from hitting the checkpoint and I died. That that's cool. Um. Yeah, so, never seen- whoa, what the- okay, never mind, I see what I gotta do. Just gotta switch conveyor belts here. No big deal. Just gonna go on this, cause that will stop if I- yeah, okay. So what happens if I hit this purple box? It transfers me somewhere? Yep, okay. What's this- what's the point of this? Okay, I guess I get a free tanuki suit, which will go to the bottom screen. And, I'm just gonna, you know, wait it out, yep, okay. Gonna move on. Oh wait, no, I'm gonna hit this. <laughs> I say I'm not gonna go out of my way to get coins, yet I'm doing that. Okay. These things are gonna propel me up any second. Yep. Oh, free coins, not bad. I got a one up. Alright. Let's see. So funny, because like, I went to GameStop at 10 o'clock, because it said it opened at 10. But guess what? It opens at 10 on every day except for Sunday, and opens at 11 on Sunday, so I like literally sat in the parking lot for an hour playing on my phone. That's cool. So yeah. Um, just gonna go down this pipe. I'm pretty sure the end of the level will be soon. Uh, yep, just as I expected. Got the one up. Alright. I'm gonna test something with the quality, Let's see how this looks. Okay, that looks really, really blurry. Okay, that's much better. Alright, just testing something. Sorry about that. Do I need to go in that mushroom thing? You know what? No, I'm just gonna wing it. Also, a nice little feature. It's got the little 8-bit um, Mario on the bottom screen there, if you notice. Like, your little cursor. It's kind of cool. And just like all the games, there's gonna be 8 worlds. And some worlds, I'm guessing, will have more than just like 4 levels before the boss. But for now, here we are at Bowser's Castle. 1-Castle. <laughs> That's cool. Trying to mix things up on me, Nintendo. Oh, cutscene. Yes. 
Sorry about not showing the intro, but like, yeah, the intro takes like a few minutes up, and I rather skip it because it's really just showing Princess Peach get captured and yada yada. So yeah, this looks already a lot more difficult than the previous levels, which is good. Um. Oh, oh my God! I forgot. If you hit fire, you just die in this game. It's not like Galaxy where you lose like one life or whatever. Maybe you die in Galaxy. I don't even know. It's, it's Mario, Super Mario 64. I'm used to that. That's what I'm used to. If you get fire, you don't die. You just, like, lose, like, two weights of your health. The long, long jumps in this game are, like, pussy. They don't even, like, jump. Alright, let me fix this camera. Okay. It's like Mario. You can't jump anymore. You're getting fatter. Like, look at this long jump, man. It's like, hang on. Yeah, he jumps, like, it's not even any longer than a normal jump. Frick, that was close. Oh. Okay, at least you don't die immediately when you- oh wait. Yeah, you don't die immediately if you have like a big Mario or anything. I'm gonna put this leaf suit on. Because the Hammer Bro is a deadly enemy, one of Bowser's biggest and baddest creatures. I don't know what I'm talking- What the f- <sighs> Okay, so you can't long jump and scuttle flutter thingy. That, that really sucks. I'm just gonna wing it with a uh, little baby mini Mario here. You know, like good old times. Not, I'm gonna try to avoid everyone I can, cause screw that star coin thing. I remember in the old game, like star coins, like all they did was I think they might have gave you new levels, but they unlocked like backgrounds or something. Oh frick! Get away from me, dry bones. Jeez. Oh. <laughs> well, that that actually had some use to it, cause now I'm big Mario at least, so I can live another hit before I die. Live another hit. Survive another hit. Difference. All right. Okay, this is definitely a little more difficult than before. Back to Heimer Bro. Just gonna use my epic long jump to get past him here. Oh no! Oh, oh, oh. Okay, we got this, guys. We hit the checkpoint. And I'm sorry, I totally moved the 3DS out of center right there. Where's Raccoon Mario? I need Raccoon Mario. Oh, what am I doing? I'm already gonna die. Maybe I need like more coins here. Can I like wall jump? Nope. I thought there'd be like a secret area up there. Yeah, chances are I won't discover any secret areas because I don't really like try to discover them. Maybe I can go up here though. Aha! Right when I say that, I discover something. That's cool. Maybe there's a raccoon Mario. Oh, that that's good too. Three one ups. Or not. Are you seeing this? These are fake one ups. How troll is that? Let me turn on the 3D real quick. Yep, they're two-dimensional. That is so troll. This game just trolled me. Okay. Um, looks like I got some more binoculars to look up. And as I could see, there's no Bowser. Yep, he left because he knew I was going to beat him. That's cool. If I drop, I won't lose life. Okay, good. Oh, I need this. I need this. If I can hit it. No, that's the one thing I didn't want. Would have way preferred Raccoon or Fire Mario here. In the future, I'll try to hold this thing more still, but I don't have like a, I don't know, I got like something to put the DS on as well as mount the camera on, so I'm not really sure how to do it. Okay, I'm gonna play this more strategically now because I want to be Big Mario by the time I get to Bowser, so I could just like power through him. Let's use my epic long jumps here. Or not. Get on dry bones. That's like your last enemy, seriously. You could have put like five hammer bros there, but instead you use a Oh oh using the rail, you see that? What a boss. Frick. Wait, cheater. Oh, oh Okay, that's right. Did I just really miss the button? Okay, thank god. Thank god. The first playthrough, I actually watched this uh, first boss online, and the dude missed the button like six times and then he died and had to redo the level. It was hilarious. Luckily I did not. I'm gonna dive in the fire to get that raccoon tail. What's the game thinking? Is that supposed to be like a trap? Nope. Not gonna do it. Just gonna power through here. Yay, Toad! You gonna talk to me, bro? Well, I'm just gonna jump up and down? Okay. I'm gonna jump up and down with you, too. What is that? Fire? Okay. And let's hit this box, and it transports us up here and looks like gives me an extra 100 there and I'm just gonna climb these things and 
do one of my epic long jumps, which doesn't do crap. And got two of the star coins there. Probably better than I'll ever do. And that is world one. That took me way too long to beat. So I'll probably be editing a little bit of it out. So it's, you know, condensing. Because right now we're 22 minutes, which is awful. But um, most of the other worlds will end up being two parts, most likely. So um, hope you guys enjoyed this. Stay tuned for more. And um, be sure to check out the game yourself. It looks really good. See you guys.